waters, the mind is not a vessel to be filled, but a fire to be ignited. Which means our mind has limitless scope. It can store wide and vast knowledge to enlarge humanity. I repeat my thought. The mind is not a vessel to be filled, but a fire to be ignited. Thank you and have a nice day. First of international news, China will make you lose your hope. Open start in Nigeria. Bangladesh Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina is announcing the largest trip there of Bangladesh on Saturday first. Now some national news. President of Egypt Abdel Fattah Sisi arrives in Delhi as a chief guest at Republic Day celebrations. Prime Minister Narendra Modi stresses on role of family in tackling stigma around mental health faced by children. Now some business news. Rupee falls 28 pesos to 81.70 against US dollar. India stands to make the financial year 24 nominal GDP growth at about 11% in the budget. Now in sports, in India vs New Zealand third ODI, India defeat New Zealand by 90 runs and take top spot in World Day rankings. In Hockey World Cup, title holders Belgium beat New Zealand by 2-0 to enter the semi-finals. Weather forecast, maximum temperature 20 degrees Celsius, minimum temperature 40 degrees Celsius, chances of precipitation 58%, humidity 100%, wind speed 8 km per hour, air quality index 153. And now, today is Hindi Titi, Mark Shukluvak Chaturthi. And that's all of today's news. Thank you and have a wonderful Wednesday. Present here. Today's word is adult franchise, spelling A D U L T. Adult F R A N C H I S E. Adult franchise meaning right to vote. Sentence: Every citizen should use adult franchise wisely. I repeat the word. Adult franchise. Thank you and have a nice day. Good morning to everybody present here. As you might all know, that it is National Water Day today, which has been a regular celebration since 2011. Today, on this occasion, I would like to share some facts about National Water Day. 25th January is the foundation day of the Election Commission of India, which came into existence in 1950. This day was first celebrated in 2011 to encourage young voters to take part in the electoral process. It is a day to celebrate the right to vote and also the democracy of India. Election Commission's main objective is to increase the enrollment of voters, especially the eligible ones. Let me tell you that earlier the eligibility age of the voter was 21, but in 1988 it was lowered to 18 years. The 61st Amendment Bill of 1988 lowered the voter's eligibility age in India. India is a democratic country. Every citizen has the basic right to vote. They have the right to select their leaders to whomever they think is capable of leading the nation. Solving the problems of common people, bringing about change, etc. Just think once that if we do not come forward and choose the right leader, then the progress and development of the country will be hampered and will also affect the people of the country. It is the leader of the country who decides various big projects and several things. If the basic system will not be developed properly, it may lead to under construction of roads, electricity connection problems, etc. Hence, we should encourage you to participate and build a strong network for the coming generation who will make sure to cast their vote without fail. Now, National Voter Day theme for the fifth year. National Voter Day theme 2022, making elections inclusive, accessible, and participative. Theme 2021, making our voters empowered, vigilant, safe, and informed. Theme 2020, electoral literacy for stronger democracy. Theme 2019, no voter to be left behind. Theme 2018, accessible elections. Theme 2017, empowering young and Future voters, theme 2016, inclusion and qualitative participation, and the theme of 2015 was easy education, easy culture. Thank you and have a nice day.
श्री एन एम कटियार प्रिंसिपल ऑफ दिस पर्टिकुलर के भी लाने टीम ऑफ टीचर्स ऑफ टी नंबर टू अरमापुर डियर स्टूडेंट्स really it's a matter of great pleasure for me also to be here this morning and to observe your assembly first of all i would like that you should clap for yourself for presenting a very nice and wonderful assembly please clap for yourself 